we've talked about you know the losses that we've seen with CRP and the potential losses that are coming and I was laying in bed the other night and I was thinking uh, about the loss of CRP and what a sad thing that is for hunting but I was also thinking about I had spent some time with my old dog that day and Finnegan here is sort of a CRP baby I guess you'd call him. Finney was born in 1994 the first year that CRP really got wet in the Dakotas and was really the start of the duck boom and so Finnegan and I enjoyed lots of wonderful times you know, as a result of CRP, whether that was shooting ducks here, uh, shooting pheasants, sharp tails, Hungarian partridge, CRP provided a lot of things for me and Finnegan to enjoy together. And it's sort of ironic that, you know, we're talking about the challenges to CRP, about the losses and the concern for the program. At the same time, my old buddy's kind of nearing the end of his rope. He's had a wonderful run but he's getting to be an old dog. He's a little crippled up now, his back end isn't working. And I was thinking about the irony of, of my old dog going away at the same time, the th very thing that gave me and my old dog so many fond memories being CRP, going away at the same time. And, and while it's very sad for me to see my old buddy sort of getting on in years and, and knowing that the and probably isn't terribly far away is is personally a very sad thing for me but I think it's a very sad thing for all duck hunters about where we're at with CRP what that means for seasons and bag limits and the fall flight of ducks and the health of our populations and not just for ducks for pheasants for deer for songbirds for shorebirds we've had some wonderful times as a result of this CRP and I think it's really important that we all you know just the way I'm going to remember my old dog and my old buddy how important CRP is the impact it had and I think we all have to be very aware of what it's going to take to get duck populations where we want them we need a vibrant CRP we need a vibrant program like CRP in Canada we need that ag policy solution to get to where we're going to get for ducks and duck hunting. And so as we understand where we're currently at with CRP and as I spend the last days with my old buddy, let's keep these memories that we've had in the last decade close at heart when we're charging forward for new solutions for ducks and duck hunting.